Hi, it's Darlene. Welcome to another card video. This week I used the same stamp set I used for my photo card so that I could show you another Christmas idea for that stamp set. So the first thing I'm going to do is get some Regal Rose ink and some Stampin' Up! paper and I'm going to ink, ink it up with my Ranger applicator. I've got this Hero Arts Flourish background stamp which I'm going to also put Regal Rose on and then I'm going to stamp off on a sheet of paper so that my image is a little lighter because I don't want it to be too overpowering on the background. This is just some basic black and I'm using Inger Sponge Dauber just to ink the edges a little bit. Now here's my Shimmer Mist which I'm going to spray about four or five times or so to get some good coverage and I just use a paper underneath to catch the excess. So here's my stamp set and I'm going to take an embossing buddy which removes the static cling from the paper so you don't get stray embossing powder on it and some Versamark ink and some black embossing powder I'm just going to heat it up with my heat tool this is a Tim Holtz paper distressor and it's got blades inside those little grooves which will distress your paper. Um, it's really easy to use and you, it's a nice cool look. And this is some garden green ink. And so when you have those distressed edges it really darkens it up a little bit when you put some ink on it. It's nice. Here's my sentiment and I'm just going to use some basic black ink. And then I'm going to take my sponge dauber again. I'm going to create a little frame around that white piece also. This is Prismacolor colored pencils. I just got just really a random green and yellow. And I'm going to color inside each of those green. And then I'm going to color the star yellow. Go ahead and adhere that piece. And I'm just using some plain black embroidery red that I got at the craft store. And I'm just going to cut three pieces, one to go down, one to go across, and one to make a bow. I'm just going to wrap around the edges. So I kind of was going for the gift box look with some ribbon on it. played with this for a while because you know how I get. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to take this third piece and I'm just going to put it underneath where they cross and tie a bow. I'm going to put that piece in the corner. I'm going to put this on a four and a quarter by five and a half folded card. I decided not to leave a white border around it, but you could leave an extra white border. This is Ranger Liquid Pearls, and it goes on kind of like a brad. It just looks like a, or, you know, like a pearl gem. But you don't have to spend a bunch of money on it. It's pretty economical. And when you apply this, you want to pull straight upward when you squeeze your bottle so you don't get it kind of drop off to the side. And that's just some yellow stickles for my stars to add a little bit of shine. And that's it. Pretty easy card. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next week. Thanks for watching.